I'm Walker. And I'm Texas Ranger. I like to picture Jesus as a ninja fighting off evil samurai. Dad, you made that Grace your bitch. You knocked that Grace out of the park. You pimped that Grace out, Daddy. I bet you God dug that. My friends and I skipped school, and we came this close to robbing a bank. I flushed Grandpa's wallet down the toilet. My friends and I skipped school, and we filled up a cup of pee and tried to get our neighbor's dog to drink it. But he wouldn't. Shut up, Chip. If you don't shut up right now, I'll push you down the stairs. Shut up, you old turd, or I'll beat you in the hell with a shovel. Shut up, Chip. We do whatever we want, you old bat. Shut your stink hole, Chip. No one cares you fought in stupid World War II. I'm ten years old, but I'll beat your ass. Huh? You feel strong? Come on. Take a run at me right now. Yeah, that's right. I didn't think so. I'm serious, Chip. I'd really love to go three rounds with you. Chip, I'm gonna scissor kick you in the back of the head. I'm gonna punk you out, Chip. Shut up, Chip, or I'll go ape shit on your ass. Chip, I'm gonna come at you like a spider monkey. Greatest generation my ass, Tom Brokaw is a punk. Chip, I'm all jacked up on Mountain Dew. Answer the lady. Did I stutter? The law doesn't apply to us. Dad, make him stop looking at me. It's all right, they do this all the time. It's called love, Chip. Stop looking. It's one of the tough things about having two parents that are hot. What can I say? Both of my parents are hot. Quit staring, Cal. It's just the birds and the bees. Get over it, Cal. Don't you have pay-per-view? Get over it, Cal. They're just knocking the boots. Daddy in the ball hole! Daddy in the ball hole! Ow! Daddy hit me! Call the police! Ricky Bobby abuses his children! Let's go drive the motor home. Yeah! Hey, sweetheart, go get me a beer, please. Come on, Daddy. scared the wussy doctor is. You're a wuss! I love hospitals! Let's go get some drugs! Yay! I want some Vicodin! I love Jenga so much it makes me hyper! <laughs> Jenga makes it okay to break things! Yay! Yay! Two Christmases! Jenga! Jenga! Woman, go fetch me a beer. Woo. The old house smells like cat urine. You better have TiVo. You look old, Granny. Are you going to die today? Shut up in here. I'm trying to sleep. One of you turds is about to get smacked in the mouth if you don't keep it down. What are you looking at, you dirty old skank? What are you looking at, Popeye? What are you looking at, you piece of road trash? What are you looking at? Jeez, I can smell you from over here. What are you looking at me for? I'm not a bottle of Jim Bean. Go shave your balls, you dusty old fart! Shut up, you old zombie, before I come over there and punch you in the choppers. Shut up, old man! Remember, oxygen's flammable. Oxygen is flammable, and I got a lighter! I don't want to have to say it again. Shut up! Shut those mutts up! Shut those damn dogs up! Shut those mutts up before I cook them and eat them! Do it, Dad. Get your balls back. Go fast again. Anarchy! 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 I don't even know what that means, but I love it. I hope you get sick and die of pneumonia, you old man. We're running hell down on you, you old crab apple. We do what we want, old man. We're young and you're old. This is only the beginning. It's going to get a lot worse, you old man. We're going to release African bees in your house. Sorry, Granny, but you're shit out of luck. We make the rules, not you. <sighs> You're gonna break us like wild horses, ain't you? What a lovely meal. I've certainly never tasted chicken fingers so fresh. Is it me or is this Applebee's food crazy delicious? It's applebee rific. I love Applebee's so much it makes me want to piss in my pants. It's so great to have a grandfather. We love you, Reese, Bobby. Maybe Reese can become a Cub Scout leader and lead us on hikes. Grandfather, can't we resolve this conflict without anger? We're sorry, Dolly, but our grandfather's troubled emotionally. We're sorry, Dolly. Our grandfather's just old drunk. Grandpa, you're talking crazy, and I freaking love it. I love where this is going. Yes, she did. I saw her. That lady is a liar. Let's burn the joint down! Daddy, even though we'll be proud of you no matter what, win. Yeah, Daddy.
They don't touch a one of them. They're mine. So what do you think that story was about? Doesn't the bear symbolize the old South and the new dog, the encroaching industrialization of the North? Duh. But the question is, should the rear feel relief or sadness at the passing of the Old South? Well, how about both? Oh, I get it. Moral ambiguity. The hallmark of all early 20th century American fiction. Great analysis, Walker. Thank you.